We're gonna start off with three on threes and just literally just work on our communication because we still don't have down the slayer. We still don't have down the damage. We don't have down laser. And what was the other one? Randy. Randy. So let's do three on threes and just focus on those things, right? Not making moves, just talking. Staying alive and talking. Then we'll go, we'll, we'll add bodies in, take bodies away, and we'll go from there. So let's get three down there and three on this side. And I will be mixing in too. So we're all five go to bunkers and nobody moves. And this is all they do. It's all they do. Uh, uh, I was just telling them, this is like kind of like a play on the Russian Legion drill. We're like, it just, just get to your spot, shoot your guns, and work on staying alive and talking. Not, it's not about moving. Okay. Cool. Yeah. I'll just let him know. Yeah, yeah. You down there. You guys only two, huh? Just two pods, just two pods. Are we, are we just kind of sticking to where we get to, or are we able to move? Eventually? You're able to move, but once you know where everyone's at, still close it out, right? Once we get up the body, Th then you basically get to your spots, figure out where ends are at, then we can make moves. Do not okay. make a move unless you know where the guy's at, right? Okay, okay. No blind moves. And then the other thing is too, try to use your teammates to make moves, right? Like if we just go here, 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 like I'd like to go to three basic spots where you see, mm -hmm. you know, instead of this guy filling the corner, have this guy fill the corner, but really emphasize like, hey, go now. I got the three to one in. I got the three to one in. All right, hey, we're in the corner. We're in the corner. Really emphasize that actual extra carefulness when you make these moves. Okay. I'll go over real quick with you guys. <laughs> Look, the, the, the whole point of this drill is like, I, I'm sure, sure Ryan told you, it's kind of like a Russian Legion drill, right? Like we're not, it's not about moving, right? So trying to get to three spots, knowing where everyone's at and then making moves on your team, right? Like if we have a guy in the home, maybe you shoot him you put the corner in and go to, you shoot the corner, you shoot the Dorito one in and send him to the corner, right? You're gonna spend 20, 30 seconds that you wouldn't have in a normal game because you're always trying to worry about the move. To actually take the carefulness, to send your guy to the corner, did he make it? You're building that process of working with your dude to make a move, right? Even when you don't have to, because that's how you're gonna get in the finals. You're gonna get in the finals, you're gonna play a fucking tough team and you're not gonna be able to gun fight your way through a single dude. Right. So really spending the extra few seconds to talk, okay. right? Game. Hey, free parking. Bring it in. Bring it in. Hey, okay, so listen. I'm gonna put these goggles on. Hey, good job. Let's get everyone in. Woody! I love you. Is there more you got changed in the chat? I don't like it. Hey, so. Free parking, free parking. So, so we we lost we lost high body situations, right? It was a two on one and a three on two. You come into the pit and you lose a three on two and a two on that hurts, right? You died making a move, right? You knew it was a two on one. Just chill, just chill. No need to force a move. We have all the time in the world, right? There is no clock in this drill. All right, don't feel like you're forced to be a move, uh, forced to do a move here. Like uh, these three on threes, we could probably do six more of them, and it could take an hour. Right? That's the, that's the pace I want to build in your head. This game doesn't have to be rushed. This game can be slowed down based on what we do. Right? We are three on two, and who you lost an engagement, right? You didn't need... I was looking to talk to Studi. I kept calling him, and I just... You just weren't protecting yourself? 
I don't. I didn't see anybody. I, I literally didn't move out. Yeah. I saw a curveball. Okay. Yeah. You gotta protect yourself. And then that's the other thing. So we we got up. We did a really good job. And then you got p picked off, right? Yeah, Tino had a good blind shot on the, the outside of that. The thing we strive to do as pay paintball players is not to lose high body situations, right? Right when we're in the three on two, it doesn't matter if these dudes make moves, right? It's just preserving your body, right? Taking the time to make that move. That move wasn't necessarily needed to be made, right? You got, you just killed the guy. Ten seconds later, you make a move. If I lose, if I lose my guy, you know what I'm doing when it's a one on two? I'm like this. If this was a video game, there's a clock above my head that just went on, right? Two and a half minutes is how much paint I have on my back. I got a pod and a loader. So now I'm fuck, fuck mode. Fuck, where are they at? Where are they at? I got to win a gunfight. I got to win a 50-50, right? So for you to move, that's the worst time to move. The second you kill someone, you're like, hey, kill two. Hey, kill four, kill four. You and me, you and me, two on one, 21, 21. Where's he at? He's on the tower. He's on me. He's on me. I don't even want to take an engagement. I'm looking at Ronnie. Ronnie's my guy. If that guy's coming to run me here, I just went, Ronnie, he's coming to get me. He's coming to get me, Ronnie. Ronnie, shoot him, right? Because the worst thing I can do is take that engagement, get shot, and now it's a one-on-one. -on -one. So preserve your bodies, right? Do not give away that body when you're up. The statistics, when you're up body, should be in our favor to win the point. All right, let's get out and do another one. It feels weird. It feels weird. You're like, oh, make a move. Do something. You feel like you should do something. Sometimes we're doing these drills, and I'm like, just call it. But this is what, this is Sunday fucking paintball. This is what Sunday paintball is. It's pop shots, people tired, their knees are sore. They've been playing all weekend, it's hot. They don't want to make the move. They don't want to be the dude to, to, to risk it and lose it. So if you train yourself to be in these situations, you're not as nervous. You're like, ah, okay, I can get used to sitting here. And this this is good. This is like this is this is good looking. Like they, I, they both think it's three on two right now. Three on two? Yeah, they but both have called. That they, they think it's a three on two. They think they have more and more kills. Start putting like a timer on these. You think? Yeah. I, well, at some point I just call it if it gets that point. Oh, okay. But otherwise, then people force to make moves. And the whole point of this is not forced to make moves. The whole point of this is just people sit in their bunkers and just talk. <laughs> okay. Yeah. True. You throw in pods, you only got two pods. And you wasted half of it. <laughs> got a handful on the way. I would have grabbed the rest of the pod. Holly, Holly. AJ. Yeah, there you go. All right, game, 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 game. Hey, good job. Hey, good job, AJ. Good job. Hey, that was good. That was good. So, hey, you three, bring it in real quick. We're going to add something next to this. No, no, you're good. Like, hey, that was a good game. We lost one body quick. Then we lost another. We lost our talker. And then you three sat there and shot your gun, stayed alive, communicate. Uh, once you start getting low on paint, then talk to your guys like, hey, let's start putting it together, right? Okay. Now we're all on the back line. We've all clocked in. We're, we're all on the same page. You're talking. He's talking, right? It, it was a three-on-three, three, not a three-on-two. They thought it was a three-on-two. I think you guys thought it was a three-on-two? I on thought two? it was a three-on-two. Yeah, so it's still three-on-three. Three. But if it's three-on-two, you make the moves. Once we get two kills, then let's start making those moves, right? Hey, hey, how do we get in the snake? Uh, Woody, Woody, what do you need to get in there? All right, AJ, get to the corner. AJ gets to the corner. Woody comes in the snake. Now you go down the field and go, right? Yeah. Decide as a unit that you're going to go close the game. Decide as a, Right now we're deciding as a unit to hide. So once we get those two kills and you get back to about your last loader of paint, then you're like, all right, hey, what do we got to do to start to make the moves? Formulate. So that, that's the next process, right? Yeah. Feel the resistance because a lot of the paintball that we do is to just go, 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 get kills or sit, sit, sit. So how do you go from gear one to gear five? And that's what we're doing right now. We're practicing gear one. Once we get two kills, then we're gonna go to the next gear. Yes, sir. All right, so let's load up and do that again. Yes, sir. Give me a couple cases of Proto in between each event. And it was the shittiest paint. So I go to the field, I dump it out, I fucking take the oil off. Yeah, yeah. I put my gun down to fucking semi-auto, 10, then we're playing 12 and a half. And I go out there and just one, one. I'm like, I got 2,000 paintballs. Why am I gonna shoot a string? You go shoot a basketball, you don't shoot eight basketballs, one basketball. One basketball, so it's like one shot, one shot. 2,000 shots can go a long way, but then you see a lot of guys go out there and they, they bring three cases, they rip through their three cases, it's one o'clock, and they're like, I'm done, going home. I'm like, 
motherfucker, you didn't even practice right. They go, it's too expensive. I was like, no, you just didn't practice correctly. Yeah. You spent $100 on paint and you, pl you played for 40 minutes. Good. That paint should be able to last you. You just like, gotta be smart about how you use it. And that one ball gets that repetition really going because it's just one. One. You're, you're thinking about it. You're concentrating on that shot, whatever the drill is. Yeah. Make sure, taking it slow, make sure you are hitting that shot. Exactly. Hit it every time. So that when you come out here, you're shooting ropes, you're hitting the rope every time. Because you can hit it one ball, you know? No, that's a good point, though. Yeah. All right, we got five more. I'm ready. Let's go. All right, one, two, three, four. Or you want to go for uh, let's see. I'm all for whatever. Let's see. Let's let's see here. Let me set this up. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna do this tower here. So I want you, I want you to come to this tower. We're gonna set Tino there. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, Tino go there. But I want one, two, three, four, five. five. No snake tower. One, two, three, four, Delta, five. Denver. Yeah. Delta, hey, Denver. Hong, because you keep confusing Echo, it. God. That's Echo God. So that means you're probably going to come to this temple. I'll go to and the then you look and see what's going in the middle. Okay. Right? You you wanted to go to this tower, right? Yeah, this Denver. Yeah. So you go to the Denver. You're going to be the 3-1. One. And you're going to the uh, Delta? Yeah. Yeah. D1 or Delta? Okay. Yeah. God on you. You're going to Rito One. Okay. And then you you stay in the home. You're oh, coming. Home. You're st you're staying here. Okay. Then, yeah. Or who or vice versa? Who's here, who wants to be home? It don't matter. We, one of you guys are coming here, and one of you guys are staying home. So go go up there. Make it in the snake, and I'll get behind you. We'll talk. Right. So we can yeah. We gotta talk. Take your time, baby. Take your time. It's it's a hey, shoot the load. Shoot the shoot, shoot the loader. Shoot a pod. When you load your last one. When you get to your last loader, that's when you're like, all right, this is my last my last line. Now I'm gonna start maybe looking for something. Let's run it. Seven, five. Yeah, that was I think I think you guys bounce them going out. I heard I heard something just. Okay. Hey, Echo went to the snake. Echo went to the snake. Hey, pull the pull. Chill, baby. Chill. You get you. I was telling him to go, and he I just know. went at the same time. He didn't go no, when I no, wanted him. No, so I know, but just ch just chill. We got those kills. We get up here. You make you don't make that next engagement, right? Just chill. Reset. Always reset, right? Come to the line here before you just come out because the guy sees you make the move. He's going to be shooting here before you engage that. Pause, right? S s pause and sense if somebody may think you made that move. Did somebody see you make that move? Are they shooting here? Are they shooting here? Are you hearing someone, snake, snake, snake? Then you don't engage. But if you don't hear anyone, then you take the rap shot. But if you always slide in there and always come up, then you're very easy to play advance because every time you let him out, let him out. Let him out. Th then you're predictable, right? I know when you dive in, you're always at a rap. So when you get in there, reset, take your time. Is it only two? No, three, three. Command, I think. 
Don't stand there. Hey, D3! Alright, snake three! Talk to Rick. Hey, snake corner, Dorito one in the home, guys. Don't stop talking, guys. Did you know it was kill four? Kill four, yeah. No. Hey, did you know it was kill four? I thought it was still a D guy. Hold up. Did, did you? I, I, I was on track, and then the last one I got, I lost the count. I did not I did know the count the there. Kill. Just, just saying because like, it's a two on one, right? And I think you knew it was kill four, right? You pretty sure? T I lost the four. I lost. T the tell him because right now he's thinking it's like a two on two or three on three, and he's about to take a 50-50 gunfight, right? Uh huh. And, and you're going to close it. And what we said, come back here. And be like, Dino, Dino, 21, 21, oh, yeah, yeah. right? Rather than going up, because you go up, now all this dude has to do is just catch Tito once down the wire, out wide, you know what I mean? Like, all he has to do while you're transitioning down the field is catch Tito, and now you're in a one-on-one. -on -one. So it's so important that you position yourself to come watch Tito. The other thing is, Tito, before you recognize that it's our snake, not snake three, our snake. So you're here, and you take the shot, you miss him, yeah, make the fill, right? Because this is your chance to kill him. But you got to at some point say, hey, our snake, our snake. Because you filled out of that temple and came back to the home. And he almost shot him. He almost shot him going from that temple to the home because he didn't know it was our snake. That's what I'm saying. It, it, it's, you know, like you're, you're in the kill mode, but if you can say, hey, our snake, our snake. Or once you take the shot, our snake. Don't take that engagement. Because you were trying to come out here to catch him rapping. Take the shot for the free kill. Not there. Our snake, our snake. Save him. Okay. That's good. No, it was good. It, 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 was a, it was a good point. I just lost that four. I knew I was on point and then I, I lost the it. Did you know I was in that? Thing? Yes. Okay. And, I, and, I, so, and I did know. So, that. so that's the other thing, too, is before you make that move in a three on three, this will. You were still alive the whole time, or did you get. I got killed right at the end of the snake. I want okay. you to tell them, hey, what's what your name again? Chris. Chris. Chris, I'm sharking. I'm sharking. Because now you go in the snake, right? There is a window for him just to come out, ride, and bunker you because you know you're in there, and you'll probably trade. Hopefully, you trade. But if you tell him like, "Hey, Chris, I'm going," AJ, he'll be like, "AJ, protect yourself. I'm watching Chris." At least he could be. You know what I mean? At least he sees you make that move. You're like, "Hey, I'm sharking, baby. I'm sharking." Just tell each other what you're doing. We are up bodies, and you got excited. You're making kills. You made a move. That's the other thing. We get up kills. Don't think we got to force it, right? They're on a time clock, right? They're starting to panic now. So do, when we get up those kills, chill, baby, chill. But it was good. It was good. <laughs> yeah, Chris was like. Hey, I, but it was per. It, it was good because. I was like, Arturo, we, be careful. We had. We, we shot Ch Chico. Out. Had had uh, Woody shoot him to the corner. He got to the corner safely. Chico made the move in. Like it was all those moves, and then we got up kills, and we know what to do, and that's why we die five on threes. It's because we know what to do in that situation. Like, oh, I gotta come here, kill this, kill this but they also know what you want to do. And that's what happened is he knew what he yeah. wanted to do. He goes in the snake and he comes out in the most pro 
predictable spot right when he wraps, mm -hmm. right? So just chill. Push it right back. Yep, let's go.